Hey everybody, I'm Stu Carter from Atomai TV and BenTenToys.net. Stand by for a Ben 10 toy review. Now this package says Ben 10 Omniverse, but this character was part of the original series. He wasn't part of the original 10 Aliens, but he appeared in the original Ben 10 series and then he was in Ultimate Alien and then Omniverse. Has not been in the reboot series yet. Name is Snero. He's derived from Ben Mummy. Let's get a close look. So this guy really started Ben 10 Omniverse days by Bandai America. Bless her hearts. I miss her toys. Snero, he comes with a little mini figure. And you notice in this packaging, he's got you got the 16-year-old Ben, and on the back of the package, you get the 10-year-old Ben, see? And these are the other characters you would get in this release. And uh, I've got some of these. I, I had Ben Mummy, mummy but uh, I think he's in storage. But you could... Oh, see, now... I've, is this Bullfrag and uh, the Sock Squatch, right? And uh, Feedback, right? Right, 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 right. And Upchuck, uh, there's been Mummy. And uh, Water Hazard, not Overflow. That's why I get those confused. And that's uh, like an uh, upgraded or well, ultimate version of uh, Spider Monkey, right? right. Chicken, Kicking Hawk, Kicking Hawk, not Chicken Hawk. Kicking Hawk, Grab Attack. This little gravity thing in, the, in his chest and di uh, diamond head, right? Who is this? And I got that character up here. Uh, he's on the tip of my tongue, but I can't remember. I, I, I do have him, though. Uh, oh, is that jury rig? Yeah, okay, okay. And see, and you get the minifigure, and it will work with this Omnitrix shuffle. See, that's how they get you. That's how they get you. You got to buy the toy. And you get the minifigure, and then you you gotta buy the Andre Shuffle. What do you want to? It? What do you want? Of course you want to. And it would uh, unlock a voice. And you put it on the shuffle, and it would unlock a voice. Now I may have one around somewhere, but I'm not going to review that today. But we'll I'll save that minifigure, of course. And if I can find a shuffle, Andre Tricks, I will test it. And I think clever young people could also use like a toothpick. To, you know, the, to make the voice come out anyway. You didn't have to have the minifigure, but of course you want that so you get the glow and all that stuff. And there's 10-year-old uh, Ben, see? Yeah. Cartoon Network, like always. Yeah. Now this package, I bought this. See, it has a sticker here because it was distributed by Bandai Asia in Hong Kong. I bought this in the Philippines. Very used. Uh, cost me uh, $5. Now, you might, if you're in North America, you might find toys like this in garage sales or used toy stores, uh, discount shops, maybe. You have to really look, okay? Because these aren't, these, these haven't been out for years. So, you know, don't expect to just pick one up, all right? All right, all right, you ready to take them out? All right, let's get them. Oh, before I forget, this was by request from Minion Boy 6000. Minion Boy 6000, thank you for requesting this. I'm glad I had it for you. So here you go, out of the box. This guy first, well he was first unlocked in the Omnitrix in the episode Under Wraps, season three of the original series, episode 34, 10 years ago, 2007. His first appearance not long after that, episode 37, season three, in the April of 2007. The, uh, the, he's changed through the years. Uh, in, in the original series, his eyes glowed green. He had the outer tricks on his shoulder. And he had the pharaoh headdress as now. And then he changed a little bit more. Ultimate Alien, he was much taller. And then in Omniverse, he, he had this final form. Composed of bandages, he could reshape his body at will. Split apart the dodge attacks. And then reform the counterattack. He can recover, regenerate easily. Ben learned, he had some trouble learning, but he learned he could extend his bandages from his body, make a wall. Yeah, ben, uh, ben Mummy, did I say Ben Mummy? Yeah, uh, Schnero is frail, but he has enhanced strength, agility, speed. He can, he can survive in space, and by like reducing himself to a single bandage, he could slip under a very tight space, slip in, in through a crack. Use his bandages to cushion the fall. Weaknesses, susceptible to strong winds and suction powers. The bandages will break, and Ben gets tangled in his own bandages sometimes. And this guy's got good articulation. I mean, 
knees and and uh, knees and, and uh, uh, hips, right? Right? No, not in the not in the uh, foot or the ankle, Sh elbows. And then uh, nice with the shoulder. Instead of trying to put it inside the shoulder, they just make the whole shoulder move. See that? That's kind of a you know saves some some money and gets the job done. Of course, the head turns. And uh, but you don't get like turning wrists. You don't get ankles that, that flex. But you can see you can see easily. And he's got really big feet, so it's easy to get a running pose. See, and he's got the little peg holes in the bottoms of his feet, just like a lot of these figures do. And uh, nice colors. I like the gold. You don't see gold in a lot of uh, these toys. In fact, I, I'm kind of I can't imagine. I can't think of when I've seen gold used in a Ben 10 toy. Do, do, do you guys? Have anything in mind that's like that? Hey, stand, uh, no, I said he stood up easily. No, he doesn't. <laughs> but g g can anyone else think of a, a Ben 10 character with gold? It's, it's yeah, it's very short, of course, and it's exotic with the uh, Fero, the Feroic headdress and the flowing bandages thing. Yeah, well, let's test out the minifigure. Commence low light testing. Oh, it's narrow. That's pretty nice. I like. I always like those. Now let's look at Snarrow on his home planet. Now it's time for some shout outs and if you want a shout out, you're going to hit that subscribe button down there, that icon, and then use the notify feature. Tell me in the comments, tell me you use notify in the comments, notification squad, otherwise I won't give you the shout out because I'm mean. Today's shout outs, Exquisite Orange and Elizabeth St. John, aren't you a movie star? Until next time, have a great day.